Step into Dana Brook Greenhouse and you walk into a sea of red and green. It's a pleasant assault on your sight. The colors, the reds, the whites, the pinks, just the vibrant color in there. The people are really uh, awestruck by that a lot of times and it makes you feel good. It's a family operation. Hold that poinsettia for me. 8,000 Christmas flowers grow here each year, waiting to be shipped to florists, churches, and organizations that sell them for fundraisers. You already know they come in a variety of colors, and you know that some people can't keep them, and some people can't seem to kill them. Yeah, overall, this is probably the most uh, difficult crop. They, they want the temperature just right to color. They, want, they need just certain amounts of water. If you put too much water or too little water, you're uh, looking for disease to set up. With poinsettias, timing is everything. You want them in full bloom when the customers want them, and that can be earlier than it used to be, with many people wanting to decorate before Thanksgiving. But forget the facts for a moment. This is more a story about beauty, the kind that comes in a pot and lasts for a season. <laughs> environment is a beautiful environment it definitely lifts you up your mood and spirits just being in the sun every day uh, you know even on a even on a cold day in the middle of winter that's 20 degrees outside the sun's out in this greenhouse you feel like you're in the middle of springtime to enjoy life we're told to stop and smell the roses in December it may be more pleasurable to peruse the poinsettias in Harrodsburg Marvin Bartlett with the spirit of the bluegrass